Tom Hunt was diagnosed with bowel cancer six years ago. He thinks if he'd gone to the doctor earlier, he could have avoided emergency treatment. My bowel perforated. I'm now the proud owner of a 12-inch long scar. Uh, had 29 titanium staples holding me together for the first few months. Um, after surgery, uh, which took a good two or three months to sort of recover from, I ended up having six months of chemotherapy. Tom's reluctance to seek help is typical of people in the southwest. Around 40% of us say we're too embarrassed to talk to our doctor about our bowel habits. Bowel cancer is the second biggest cause of cancer deaths in the UK, and the number of people developing it is increasing. But if caught early, the prognosis is significantly better. If bowel cancer is contained in the bowel, then the rate of cure is over 90%, and that's cure. If it's spread beyond the bowel, then that starts to go down below 50% over five years. A survey carried out by Bowel Cancer West showed that 90% of people don't know enough about the symptoms of bowel cancer, and only 60% take part in national health screening programmes. Bowel Cancer West is campaigning to combat the so-called cringe factor, encouraging us to be more prepared to talk about our concerns and more aware of the symptoms of the disease, which include a change in bowel habits, abdominal cramps, bleeding, anemia or sudden weight loss. All I think back to is if I'd gone to the doctor when I first had symptoms, there's a chance I wouldn't have had to go through six months of chemo, there's definitely a chance I wouldn't have had emergency surgery and it would have just been a nicer experience to go through than the one I had, but c'est la vie.